I haven't done an update in a while. Um, as long as it's not on my hip. And yes, we're back in the hot tub because I can be in the hot tub again and I'm not going to miss out on it. Um, so we are starting into week four right now. And the reason I have makeup is I thought I was going to have dinner with my friend today, but I either, either she forgot or she meant next week when she said next week, next week, last week. I don't know. Um, <laughs> so yeah, um, it's, we're into week four. I've been going to PT for about two weeks now. Uh, my insurance is having some fun there. They were like, they only authorized seven sessions and my PT kind of went to them like, she had surgery and a surgery that usually takes six months of PT. So could you authorize that again? Um, so I have, I may not get to go on Monday. Um, that's okay though. If I don't get to go Monday, I'll go Thursday and Friday. Um, but it's been interesting. It's been very interesting. Um, just, I'm off, I'm not 100% off the crutches if I have to go, like, walk around a store, like, beyond a small amount, I will use my crutches still, because it still hurts to walk too much, um, but around my house, um, go, now going into PT, I keep them in the car, but I do, uh, mostly walk without the crutches, not without pain, but without the crutches. The, um, pain's been getting worse, obviously, as I'm now uh, applying weight to the crutches, and, um, yeah, it's not the funnest, but I am healing. <sighs> Had a couple missteps early on. Uh, I slipped going down the garage steps. Only two steps, but I, I kind of took a tumble. Caught myself on my good foot, but I whipped my bad leg. Um, I've had... Um, I, I twisted. I, I took a little bit of a slip getting out of the hot tub like yesterday. So my, my bad leg shifted real quick and that wasn't fun. No super hard falls. No big worrisome incidents or anything, so I'm okay there. Um, the loneliness is killing me. Uh, being basically isolated from everyone for weeks because I'm not working. I did do one massage on my friend and she came over for it this week and just to test if I could go back to work next month and I'm pretty sure I can. I just had to be uh, with restrictions, so only like one hour massages, only like one a day, maybe two if I really think I can push it, but, um, that's, that's, that's something. Got my stitches out on week two and a half. <laughs> stitches are out. Um, I'll show the incisions off a different day, because obviously I am in, I'm not decent right now for, um, upper thigh showing but all in all um it's going it's going well enough it's just um pain and i will admit feeling some of the pain that's getting worse as i'm off my crutches makes me scared that like not all the pain will go away and that is a little troublesome in my head but i'm trying not to think about that because it all makes sense they drilled through my hip. I gotta see the pictures too. That was cool. Um, but you know, they drilled through my hip. That's probably where it hurts the most when pressure is applied. Um, and that place is just really angry in general. So that's gonna take a while to heal. I mean, full healing is six to eight months. It's not like, all oh, because I'm off crutches that this is gonna get better. No, it's six to eight months to be mostly back to normal. It's three months to be able to function mostly normal. Um, so... I'm only at three, and like, I'm just starting into four weeks, so, yeah, I'm just, yeah, it's, it's, it was four weeks Tuesday, so, I'm just starting into four weeks, so, it's okay if it hurts, it's bound to do that, and I need to accept that it will, and be okay with it, um, yeah, so that's really it, this is gonna be a pretty short video, because there's not too much to say about it, it's definitely been easier than I thought it'd be, 
but I also know it's going to be different for everyone, so don't take it as my being. I mean, <laughs> the, the, the headache, that migraine I had, um, I am going to make a video on that at another point. Um, but besides the first, if you take out the thunderclap migraine, then it wasn't that bad. That was bad. The rest of it, not so bad, you know. Getting around crutches is annoying. Um, turning over at night is probably the most painful thing right now. Because uh, I will, I, it just, it's sore all the time. It's sore. And there's not much I can do about it. Because we're doing PT now. We're doing strengthening exercises, which hurt it, which aggravated it. It swells up at night. Um, that's it. But yeah, so that's all I really have to say about the, um, the surgery and the labrum stuff. So... I don't know if I'll do another update on this or not. We'll see. It might be a while if I do. Um, but I will be making a different video for a few other things. And yeah. So thanks for keeping an eye on me. And seeing how I'm doing by watching this video. And hopefully if anybody's watching this who's about to have this surgery, uh, this is helping if anything. You know, following my little story, uh, feel free to in the comments if you have any questions about my experience but overall yeah all right bye, -bye.